What's cracking everybody? The wet one back here again for yet another Friday video uh, for you guys right now. I'm out here hanging out with some of the boys. We got my buddy Aaron right over here. What is that in your hand, bro? Nothing. What is that in your hand? Nothing. <laughs> what is, oh, Malibu? We also have my, my buddy Jacob and my buddy David. The last time I hung out with him is when we were out there clowning around. Yeah. You know, getting, or I was getting pied. It was your birthday. Yes. But now you're a year older. Yeah. And a little bit shorter. A little bit shorter. Yep. Yep. But uh, we're out here just messing around today. This is this could be a random kind of. Just a chill Friday night. We're gonna go to this little cigar lounge that we we hang out at. Our, our home. Our home, yeah, home away from home. Yep. Away from home. But the place we're going to is a place called Cigar Sanctuary uh, out here. Let's head on in. Oh. Are they passing our freebies? Yeah. Oh, now you can buy the boxes. Yeah, that's all good. Let's head on in. So, Aaron, are these the cigars you guys are going to try tonight? Yeah, it's called Swamp Fang. Not Fang, but Fang. Huh, okay. I'm not a big cigar person or anything like that, but my boys like to come into the cigar sanctuary uh, over here. They have a big selection of, uh, you know, different cigars you can pick from, all, all sorts of different prices. But there's a special room that we're able to uh, just hang out and chill out. Let's go. As the boys are over there giving their cigars and stuff, they usually have this little like kitchen area over here where you know sometimes the owner gets like orders food like pizza or like other random stuff and anybody that's here can have it and get some, you know, it's kind of cool. Uh, it's a cigar sanctuary. Hey, I was just telling them about this little ki kitchen area that they have yeah. and sometimes like they bring pizza for us, or, you know, for the people that, that are here. Oh, yeah. Super Bowl, they run a whole lot of food. Yeah, I think it's kind of cool, their little so this, this swamp thing. What does it smell like? It smells like manure, actually. It it smells, smell it? Ooh, it does. It smells, it, smells like, like, it smells like poo poo. It smells like you're in the middle of the country or something. It does a little bit, yeah. Yeah, it's made in, I think it's like Kentucky. Did, or did like you that. smell it? Yeah, it smells, it smells good. Like, it smells like uh, manure. It smells like poop. <laughs> no, it smells like uh, wheatgrass from a pet shop. Huh. Just made it to the back room right here. Is this like a special? This is like a special club, huh? In a way. There's a lot of cool guys here. Okay. Yeah, I know, yeah, the ones that we hang out with and talk to sometimes. Yeah. There's an old guy who usually sits in the corner over here and he's, he's not. Always here, but not yeah, he's not here today, yeah. Sure, he gonna light up the swamp thing. Hungry. So boys, where are we heading off to? What is it? Wild wings? On a Buffalo Wild Wings. Okay. He's, we're, never we're, been, he's never been before. I love it. He's been there. I, I, I've been there once a long time ago. I think we should go because you said there's something about those spicy wings, right? Yeah, like we said, the place we're going to is Buffalo Wild Wings. Hopefully it's not too busy. So the food just came. Everyone got some wings over here. Oh, yeah. what, what did you end up getting? Buffalo. The Buffalo one? What about you, Jay? And you got some like weird like poo poo looking ones. Got some garlic parmesan. Garlic parmesan? Well, it's really loud in Buffalo Wild Wings. I didn't end up getting any wings. I was thinking about getting some like, you know, like the, the, the really spicy ones. It was like 20 bucks and shit. I ended up going to this place I probably shouldn't have. It's called uh, Cookie, Cookie Dough Dream. And got uh, some chocolate cookie dough slash like ice cream stuff that they have in there. But uh, just trying this out for the first time, and it's it's not bad. It's like ice cream slash mixed with cookie dough, and um, it's all right. I got done eating my little thing. You guys got done with your uh, wild wings. Yeah, man, it was loud in there, dude. Yeah, it was. I don't even know if you guys can hear the little it's crowded clip. too. Yeah, it was. But it is Friday night, so. Yeah, it was insane. It's kind of kind of crazy. Like the loudness kind of gets to me sometimes. Good time, chill out time with the boys. Uh, we really should have saw a movie tonight, but maybe maybe next hangout Friday and check this shit out. What? It's just like out here back a dumpster and stuff. Like our car's parked over here. Hey, we buy souls. Uh, Brennan, I think you need to call that number. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? Thank you for calling Rabbi Perry. We 
by souls of all shapes, sizes, and color, regardless of your sexual orientation by pop, pronoun, or gender. Before purchase, please listen to the following options. For black souls, press 1. For Asian souls, press 2. For white souls, press 3. For all other inquiries, please leave us a detailed message about what kind of person you are and what you think your soul is worth. Please, be honest. Our associates are standing by. Hello? Hello? I'm here to sell my soul. And my hole. <laughs> Hello? Yo hablo espanol. Piquito? I guess that's it. What? <laughs> I don't know. This is a scam. Like, Maybe should, we should have picked uh, the uh, Asian or black one. Yeah. Was, yeah. Was, that was one or two, right? Like they, they said, Asian souls and black souls, right, David? I did. And then they it, it, look, look, it was Asian souls, black souls, and wet souls. Yeah. What kind of shit is that? <laughs> I don't know. That was weird, dude. Calling that number and shit. Yeah. Like now I'm like, is my number gonna be like on their system or some shit? No, you're, you're on some system. <laughs> you're, on, you're on some list, dude. <laughs> that was random as shit. But we gotta go to 7-Eleven to get a couple of things for tonight or whatever. Dude, dude, I'm getting a phone call. We just got to 7-Eleven. I'm getting a phone call from this restricted number. Hello? Yes. Who is Summit B? Who is this? You may call me Alistair. What the? Oh, what? what the? <laughs> what the? What? <laughs> so, who are? Who is this? You may call me Alistair. Hello, Alistair. So you buy? Are you, are you part of the We Buy Souls sign? Oh God! Yes. Oh God! Oh, oh. Yes. So what? What do you? How much do you? How much does it cost to buy a soul? Like, how much am I going to get? That all depends. <laughs> I must sleep with my goat. You, you what? You have to. I have to sleep with your goat. <laughs> oh God! Oh my God! Oh my god. Oh. So I called the number. I am a, a fat white male. What 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 can I get for my soul? Not much. I have a friend with me. His name is Aaron. He's a he's a film director and oh my god. this is because we like the ones from the industry. But yeah. he's like he's like really 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 into pigs. So, when did you guys start posting up these signs and and stuff? Why so many questions? I, I just want to know. Like, how, do I do I have to meet you somewhere to give you my soul? Do you just come and take it and shit? Yes, we do come and take it from you. Do you take it? How how, how does the soul come out? Does it come out? Do you get it out of my mouth or does it come out of my 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 hole? Rectally from the root. <laughs> Are there lambs there and sheep and goats and all that? That this is not so, Jacob. Do you, I have a, I have a, two or three friends with me right now, and one of them's name is Jacob. Um, would you like to do anything with him? Yes, the more the better. I mean, how, how much money can we get for four souls? Maybe like twenty dollars. Mm, perhaps. <laughs> it all depends. When would you like to meet? Um. Where 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 do we meet you at? Um, can you come to Hollywood? Oh, God. Guys, yes. I, don't we, I don't know if we should be doing this, guys. This is kind of like... Kind of quiet. Man. The goats do get quite loud. Oh, man. Oh, um, well, we'll, we'll, we'll call you back when we decide if we want to sell our souls or not, okay? Yes, and bring waffles. <laughs> <laughs> Will do. Like I said, we're already at 7-Eleven. We're going to be heading on in there. I don't know if I'm gonna go uh, meet the soul, the soul taker, the soul sucker. You guys are getting some uh, Oreo ice cream. Yeah, I saw somebody get these at a CVS one time, and I was, and I love anything cookies and cream, especially Oreo. So yeah, yeah. Have you ever seen that sign before? Ever? Never. Never. It, it, that's crazy. Just got out of 7-Eleven. I didn't end up getting jack shit. I just got some like water and stuff. 
water and a um, Gatorade. But what, you guys got those cones. It's an Oreo cones, yeah. It's pretty good. Yeah? Is this the first time you ever got that one? Uh -huh. Pretty good. Yeah? Oh, pretty well, good. You, got, you got the pie, right? I got the pie and a cookie. Ooh, and cookie, cookie too? Fuck yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Have you guys ever tried the the instant pizzas that 7-Eleven has? Yes, I have, and they're pretty damn good, actually. I, yeah, I, I never have, but... One day, bro, we'll have to do that. Yeah, every day and every way. But guys, we're coming down to the end of this little uh, video adventure today. That that sign thing was strange. That shit was strange as fuck. Yeah, if you ever see it, don't don't call it. It's <laughs> probably best you don't call it. Yeah, like... <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Aaron took... Aaron, we have the sign in Aaron's car now. But, um... That, that was definitely random as fuck. Uh, definitely. It's, it's a Friday night in, uh, in Los Angeles, so. Yeah, guys, like, you guys can actually call that number and see what happens if for your fucking self. Yeah. In case you guys think this is all bullshit. We were laughing because it was kind of, like, hard not to for what some of the shit the guy was saying. Call that number. You'll see. Yeah. You'll see. You'll get, like, 50 bucks for your soul. Yeah, I'll probably get, like, you know, $2 in a Slim Jim or some shit. <laughs> 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 but, uh, don't, who, whose soul do you think is worth more? That's what we should have asked. Do you think he can? Do you think the guy can tell that? Well, they wanted us to be honest and tell them how much we think our souls are worth. Yeah, I know it was weird. The guy, the guy kind of sounded like Wishmaster or some shit. Yeah. <laughs> like an, an, like Andrew Divoff or some shit. Yeah, very weird. Yeah, but this is all this is all for a little Friday night hangout video. If you guys liked it, hit that thumbs up button and uh, follow David. Follow David on his uh, social media. Uh, I think I'll have like a Twitter down there. Yeah. Is that the main one? Yeah, Twitter, Instagram, at Mr. Coker, M-I-S-T-E-R-K-O-C-H-E-R, Twitter, Instagram. Yep. Make sure you guys check him out. I think, you know, Aaron doesn't really mess around with that stuff at the moment. And <laughs> Jacob, he's, he's, he, 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 hangs out, he, he hangs out in chats where he makes a lot of porno. <laughs> but uh, thank you guys so much for watching. See you next time.